Seth Freakin' Rollins, and this is Brett Alive on YouTube. What is going on, guys? Brett Alive back with another video, and today we have three figures from Elite 83. We got Dusty Rhodes, Drew McIntyre, and Sasha Banks. Pick these figures up from Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigures.com, using discount code LIVE at checkout to save 10% off our entire shopping cart. L-I-V-E, all caps, saves 10% off at checkout, guys. If you guys want to save some money, L-I-V-E, all caps, saves 10%. Uh, really quick, guys, if you guys did not already see, King Corbin and Edge, those two figures are on the channel now. Freaking insane review video. Those are awesome figures, so I really suggest that you guys go check out that video. But in this video, again, Dusty Rhodes, Drew McIntyre, and Sasha Banks, we're going to be taking a look at all of them unboxing all of them so without further ado let's bloody do it okay guys we're gonna start with drew mckinfart i pff, i mean drew mcintyre right here very very cool also from elite 83 right there wwe logo true effects that skin technology there's a look at drew mcintyre right there elite collection certified uh, authentic drew mcintyre there's a look at him in the packaging uh, oh man i'm interested to see how that smiling head scan turned out so i'm gonna definitely again we're gonna get out of the box take a closer look there's a picture of drew on the side elite collection one more time there's another picture of drew right there there's some info on the back right there if you guys would like to pause the video to read I'm interested also to see if this is his WrestleMania attire. Uh, I could. It says it's WrestleMania right there, but I'm interested to see uh, if it is, actually is. There's some uh, other people on the set. Again, you got Edge and King Corbin. Again, review on the channel. Go check it out. Dusty Rhodes, Drew McIntyre, and Sasha Banks. Comes with the open interchangeable hands. Or was the completely open grappling hands. And of course, it wouldn't be a Drew McIntyre figure without the entrance jacket. And recently, he just changed his entrance look. Now he wears a kilt to the ring, and he has a freaking sword. So we're going to need another Drew Elite. God darn it. But uh, yeah, there is a look at the entrance jacket. I love this zipper. Freaking long zipper going all the way down. Otherwise, yeah, a bunch of different just metal chains hanging down. Silver studs going all the way around. Very nice buckles right here. I love these just hanging there. Just looks great. There's a look at the back. Wow. That is just so fresh looking. And of course, here we have the Drew McIntyre figure. Let's take a look at the head scan. Uh, pretty nice looking head scan. I think it looks like Drew McIntyre. Do I think it's all there? No. But I do think it looks like Drew McIntyre. I like the smile. I think that's pretty cool. Because, yeah, he, he, he does smile in the ring. Right when he's about to deliver that Claymore kick. Countdown from three. Get to zero. Boom, Claymore. That is so cool. Or get to one and then hit the Claymore. But, yeah, I... I like the head scan. I think it's cool. I like the beard as well. It's pretty awesome. Uh, same hair mold that they've been using in the past, partially in the back. One little piece here in the front. If you wanted, you could put that in the back, heat it up. If you wanted, you could heat it up and put it in the back. But yeah, I do like it. It makes a little may look a little more messier. And then there's a look at the torso. They are using the Triple H torso. In the render photos, they did show him with a new torso. So that's pretty odd that we're getting this same torso again. Uh, yeah, which is, I mean, it's fine. I mean, it looks good. And there's some stubble on the chest right there looking cool and then you also do the black wrist tape on both wrists here's a look at the trunks looking pretty similar to what we've seen in the past you do have the nice little cross swords right there on each side and on the back i love that logo i freaking love that logo you got the beasts logo with a sword going right through it he wore this a lot too on the Monday Night Raws after WrestleMania, he wore it a lot. It's like very recent where he just stopped wearing this attire very recently. And then there's a big circle. I love that logo. That is so cool. And then you also do have the black kick pads or not kick pads, knee pads, and then the black boots. And then, of course, there's a look at Drew McIntyre with his robe on. It fits great. It's tight. He looks jacked still in it. I love the look of that back, dude. That is just so fresh looking. Okay, guys, moving into Dusty Rhodes. And then last, we're going to get into Sasha Banks. But yeah, there's Dusty Rhodes right there. Very cool. In his packaging, he's got that. Yeah, we're, we're going to get it open. Don't worry. There's a look at the packaging. It's very similar to Drew McIntyre's true effects. Very, very similar. There's a picture of him on the side. Very, very cool. And then there's another picture of him right there. It's going to be pretty cool to get this out of the box. Put it with my updated AEW uh, Cody Rhodes and Dustin Rhodes. That's going to be pretty awesome. There's some info on the back if you guys like to pause the video to read. And then there are the other people in the set. Edge, Drew McIntyre, Dusty Rhodes, King Corbin, and Sasha Banks. So without further ado, let's get this figure right out of the box. He comes with the John Cena You Can't See Me hands, the open chokeslam hands, and just the fisted hands. We're also getting this really cool accessory. It's a pretty cool, like, like Mad Hatter, like, magician top hat right here. Very, very awesome. I love that. Brand new mold, by the way. And what's pretty cool, you could actually take this off. And if you wanted, you could use it as a necklace on the Dusty Rhodes figure. If you wanted. But I'm going to leave it on the hat. I think it looks way better on that. But other than that, I think that's like a... 
like a bird claw right there, right on the hat, which is so unique and so cool. And then we also do have this big imposing entrance piece right here. It's sort of like a big hang over his body entrance piece. That's what I'm going to call it. I like how these ends are split. You could feel all that. They're all split, which is so cool. And then you also do have the iconic Dusty Rhodes dots going around in red all over this thing. Here, I'm going to open it up all the way. Very, very cool. And then there's a hole right there, of course, for Dusty Rhodes' head. <laughs> Speaking of Dusty Rhodes, here he is. Very awesome. I like that head scan. Not sure. Somebody let me know down in the comments below. But I think that is a brand new head scan for Dusty Rhodes. Very cool. I love the look on his face. Pretty cool. He's got the tongue sort of hanging out. I like the eye. Oh, man. It just looks super good. I like the hair as well. All just messy right there. He's got the fully bleached hair. Similar to what Cody has right now. Very cool. I like that. And then also on the torso, you do have the big birthmark right there, which is pretty cool. Big, just imposing figure. Look at that. There's a look at the right arm. He does have the black arm tape with the red elbow pad covering it. He's got the white wrist tape as well. Moving down to the trunks, main color is black with the red dots going around that as well. And they continue all the way to the back. Moving down, he also does have the black kick, uh, not kick pads, I don't know why I keep saying that, knee pads, black knee pads, and... Some pretty cool looking boots. Look at these, some cowboy boots right there. He's got the flat tip with a nice little logo there on the size that says Rhodes. Now imagine, yeah, it does say Rhodes right there. Very cool. And nice looking eagle right there. Black decals all over these cowboy boots. And of course, we do have Dusty Rhodes with all of his accessories on. Looking like an absolute beast. I love that entrance piece. That is so cool. Hey guys, moving into the last figure in this video, we got Sasha Banks. With the blue hair. Yes, the brand new blue hair. I'm very interested to see how that entrance jacket works. It's supposed, supposedly like the arm pieces come off similar to the Kyrie Sane Elite that we got in the past. So I'm pretty interested to see how that's going to work. Sasha Banks engraved on the side. Very similar to package the other ones. Yeah, I've basically already shown it. Sasha Banks on the side. You get the Elite Collection logo right there. Another picture of Sasha Banks looking awesome there. There's some info on the back. If you guys like to pause the video to read. And the other people in the set for the last time, Edge and Baron Corbin. I really suggest to go check out that video. Drew McIntyre, Dusty Rhodes, and Sasha Banks. She does come with the fully open hands and then the open foreign object holding hands. We also do have the legit boss blue glasses. I love how you can see the lettering in the lenses. That is so cool. And also we do have, I'll put those right there, uh, the, I think the tiniest accessory ever uh, that we've ever gotten with a WWE figure. Look at this. Oh my gosh, I can barely even hold them. Oh my gosh, can I get them up close? Look at that. Legit boss. This one's upside down. Legit boss brass knuckles right there. Fully gold. You got the little handles on the back right there. Oh, my gosh. They are so tiny. There's my thumb. And then there's one on top of my thumb. Holy crap. Look at that. That's so crazy. This thing. Look at this. This thing is sick. The entrance jacket for this Sasha Banks is so cool. I would have loved, I really would have loved to the to get a cloth good with this, like like this in a cloth good, I think that would have been way cooler. But this is this is this is sick. This is so cool. These arm pieces, yes, I was right. These do come off, um, very easily, very easily. Got this right off the Sasha Banks figure. Very cool. I love the silver. There's just so much to talk about. You got these little things hanging down. The blue, the silver, the black, the back. Get ready, guys. Get ready. Look at that. That is so sick. Says the legit boss. Oh my gosh, I love the blue drip hanging down. You got the silver all covering the top, the black, and then the like the blue flame design going down, sort of. That is so crazy. Uh, I feel like it's going to be a nightmare to get back on the, on the Sasha Banks figure, but we are definitely going to have to do it for the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. And of course, here we have the Sasha Banks figure. Correct me if I'm wrong, brand new head scan. I like it. I really, really like it. I think that looks very similar to Sasha Banks. Very cool. Look at that blue hair, man. Uh, second time we're actually seeing the Sasha Banks blue hair. She did have a basic with like promo gear on with the blue hair, but I'm glad we're getting it in the in the wrestling gear form. That is so cool. I can't wait to get the blue. Uh, well, I already have one, but I'm going to put the uh, blue uh, women's championship on it. It's going to look so cool. So, so excited for that. There's a look at the top. You got the black front with the uh, blue strap. Blue and white straps going all the way around her arms. You got the black wrist tape. If my camera would focus. There's a look at the back. Very cool. I love all of this. Covering the arms. White wrist tape on this side. Very cool. And then there's a look at the trunks. Pretty cool. You got the blue and white on the sides. And as you move to the back, 
There's some nice little squares there. Boom! Sasha Banks. Look at that logo. It's just the smallest little logos on this figure are just so sick looking. I love that. Sasha Banks right there with ni some nice blue color going around it. You got the white little backing. And then here, look at, here are the look at the uh, knee pads slash kick pads and shoes. Look at that. Look at this white on the back. It says boss. And it says legit. So legit boss. That's so cool. And then you got the white there. The flame design. The black. That is just so sick, dude. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, before we go, here we have Sasha Banks with all of her accessories on. Even if you look closely, she does have the little brass knuckles on. That is so cool. They look great. Be careful. Do not lose them. They are so easy to lose. They are so tiny. But yeah, the jacket, I hate to say it, is a nightmare to get on. But give it some time. Give it some time, and then you'll get it on. Don't rush it. Do not rush it. Otherwise, you'll break the figure. But uh, give it some time. You will end up getting it on, and it just looks amazing. I love the glasses as well. It ties in so good with the blue hair. Okay, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to smash the like button. Comment down below your favorite figure. Also, pick these up from Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigures.com, using discount code LIVE at checkout to save 10% off. That's the only place you can get them right now. Uh, Sasha Banks, that figure's getting an 8 out of 10. Dusty Rhodes... 8 out of 10. Drew McIntyre, 8 out of 10. All these are getting 8s out of 10. I think they're really cool. My favorite one out of these three is definitely Sasha Banks. That's such a cool figure. But yes, guys, again, discount code live at ringside saves 10%. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bread alive. Out.